good morning everyone my name is prashant i am from second year btech from cscc today i am going to give a presentation on approaches to end user applications probability in the cloud a survey let's start introduction cloud computing is a paradigm for swiftly provisioning a shared pool of configurable resources on demand it has three key factors software as a service platform as a service and infrastructure as a service applications are offered to end users as software as a service while infrastructure as a service ensures efficient use of involved physical resources paas is responsible for provisioning these applications this article takes an end user perspective and focuses solely on end user cloud applications the reader should note that there are other applications in the cloud that are not considered here the ultimate goal of cloud computing is to provision such applications in a rapid and cost effective manner a key to the success of end user application providers in cloud settings is portability portability aids in preventing vendor lock in end user applications portability means the ability to move end user applications from paas to paas it also means the possibility of provisioning end user applications across several paas or more precisely the components deployment of the same end user application across several paas this ppt discusses the potential advantages of component based application for travel agencies using a booking portal as an example the focus is on making end user applications portable allowing deployment of components in various platform as a service environments with minimal integration efforts the choice of paas is influenced by factors like security and cost the article proposes actions such as deploying exist- existing components from marketplace and moving deployed components to new paas based on changes in pricing it evaluates existing approaches to end user application portability emphasizing its focus on in depth analysis compared to related surveys requirements for cloud end user application cloud end user applications life cycle cloud end user applications provisioning involves three phases development deployment and management in the development phase the end user application is created tested and its executables are built encompassing encompassing all necessary files for execution the development phase includes allocating and preparing platform as a service resources for hosting the application as well as uploading its executables to these resources overall these phases encompass the entire life cycle of cloud and user applications from creation and deployment to ongoing management requirement for the deployment phase during the deployment phase of cloud and user applications the allocation of necessary resources and the upload of executables involves specific deployment settings descriptors and operations these include deployment manifests like cloud foundries and deployment apis such as cloud foundries push app operation a crucial requirement is the establishment of standards for these descriptions and operations as each pas imposes proprietary development procedures on developers In the example of travel agencies booking application deploying the portal component requires distinct descriptors and operations for each target PAS standardization is essential to streamline these varied deployment procedures across different PAS platforms requirement for management phase in cloud environments management operations for end user applications can be categorized into classical operations and additional operations like migration facilitating and transfer of modules between providers the third crucial requirement is the establishment of standards covering the entire spectrum of management operations encompassing both classical fc aps and additional operations paas platforms expose managemental features through platform specific operations which vary between platforms even if a particular management operation is available on two pas platforms their specifications may differ for instance application scalability settings in google app engine are automated based on service level agreements 
while cloud foundry they remain manual standardization is essential to ensure consistency across diverse pas environments topology and orchestration specification for cloud applications the topology and orchestration specification for cloud applications tosca outlines specifications for describing cloud resources and application topologies as typed graphs promoting portability tosca encompasses both cloud end user applications and their hosting environment topologies it simplifies application management and enhances component reusability tosca represents cloud applications and platform resources as nodes with defined relationships in topology templates structured as typed graphs a cloud service archive csr encapsulates all tosca elements and plans using a travel agency's booking application as an example tosca service templates schematize components relationships and pass resources providing a comprehensive representation of the application and its hosting environments here is a diagram of tosca service templates associated with the travel agency's booking application here as you can see travel agency booking app service template there is web portal and it branches into three hotel booking car rental and payroll same as in hostel environment one service template web server and message router in the two service template web server and dbms now there are two plans plan 1 and plan 2 okay now the use of cloud service architecture csr archives addresses the standardized application executable format requirement ensuring content encapsulation and language independence however most current platform as a service offers lack of support for csr deployment except for a few research prototypes the introduction of service templates and plans in the topology and orchestration specification for cloud applications meets the need for standardized deployment descriptors and operations the dot tosca document with csr describes several template topology and properties while plans implemented as workflows detail deployment information like resource requirement and orchestration process overall widespread adoption of tosca would require existing pass pl- platforms to align with its specifications for handling tosca based end user applications now let's look at cloud application management for platforms now cloud application management for platforms short form cam proposes a specification for homogeneous deployment and management procedures in heterogeneous platform as a service environments components representing end user application or pws resources are part of an assembly describing the entire application and required platform resources plans with an assemblies refer to needed pws services camp introduces the platform deployment package pdp format for standardized application execu- executables but its support is limited to some pas prototypes however the vocabulary is not comprehensive for all pas resources there is no information on extending it camp falls short in standardizing the complete set of management operations as a generic rest based apis lack like f caps operations now let's look at work done within research products and acad- projects and academia cloud for soi offers an architecture for deploying and managing end user applications in diverse plat- platform as a service environments emphasizing service oriented architecture deployment the architecture comprises three layers semantic soi and governance cloud for soi uses moda clouds for implementing and connects to cloud offerings like cloudbees and amazon aws evaluation reveals 
that while it lacks support for standardized application executables it meets requirement for deployment descriptors and operation provi- providing a harmonized api for common deployment However, it falls short in standardizing the complete set of management operations as generic REST-based APIs do not include FCAPS operation. MOSAIC An open source project aims for data, service and application portability across multiple clouds. It includes three layers, application support, software platform support and infrastructure support. MOSAIC introduces the concept of cloudlets for standardized application executables. allowing language independence and generic management it meets requirement for standardized deployment descriptors and operation but lacks standards for the entire set of management operations it limited support for applications governance and deployment operations and its cloud adapters here is a diagram okay. so moving on into a research direction the diversity in formats for cloud and users application executables influenced by programming languages and cloud runtimes prompts the exploration of novel programming language independent formats the open virtualization format stands out as a potential starting point due to its portability for virtual machines but refinement refinement is needed to address cloud application specific set the platform as a service level while existing work introduces Ontologies for deployment descriptors they fall short in covering the extensive range of heterogeneous platform resources and their revolving characteristics. The proposed solution involves hierarchical ontology to flexible to flexibly accommodate novel concepts, allowing for more comprehensive and adaptable representation of past resources. Conclusion: Portability is key to the ubiquitous development of cloud and user applications. This PPT has introduced an illustrative use case and derived requirements for enabling portability in such a context. These requirements have been used to critically review the projects proposed so far in standards bodies, international projects, and academia. None of these approaches, however, fully meet all requirements. Research direction for meeting each requirement have also been discussed. We hope that the identified research directions can guide the community in designing solutions that will allow effective application portability. Thank you.